life story of Nonso. So Nonso woke up with pink eye, he was uncomfortable, he was feeling a bit of pain in his eye, and it was pink. So he got into a call with Ebuka, and then after they talked, they were friends, and they hailed each other, and, ah, guy, why do they sound like this? Nonso is like, oh, my eye is kind of pinkish, it's red, I'm uncomfortable, it'd be like saying a polo. Ah. Ebuka was like, ah, use, um... Use um, what is the name of this drug? Chloramphenicol. Use chloramphenicol. Now, isn't I use and I feel better? And the friend, um, Nonso was like, Hey, a guy, thank you. You do well for your boy. So, Nonso went to a chemist and asked that they give him chloramphenicol. So, he went home, opened the capsule, and poured it into his eye. <laughs> Guess what? It melted the black parts of his eye. He became blind in that eye because he followed his friend's advice. It's not like um, Ebuka's advice was bad, no. But because he wasn't a professional, he, instead of saying chloramphenicol eye drop, he said chloramphenicol. And he went to the chemist and they gave him chloramphenicol because of course there's capsule, there's capsule. So when you get professional advice from somebody who is not a professional, there are some details that are life-saving they don't pay attention to. So from this story, what have you learned? Have you subscribed to this channel? Are you following? Are you following? Did you get value from this? Did you learn anything? I want to see your comments in your comments in the comment section. <laughs>